Hello everyone, welcome to the family of atomic mathematics. In this video, we will solve one problem from trigonometry. Here the question is solve for x and the equation is sin x whole to the power 5 plus cos x whole to the power 5 equals to 1. We have to solve this equation. So let us rewrite the equation again. And this implies Now uh, let us use the facts that sin square x plus cos square x equals to 1. So this implies and from here we have Now, uh, this can be written as Now note that we know that sin square x is a positive number So, sorry, positive quantity So, this is positive And also sin cube x is always less than or equal to 1 So, therefore, 1 minus sin cube x is again greater than 0 and similarly, cos square x is greater than or equals to 0. Also, 1 minus cos cube x is also greater than or equals to 0. Therefore, this quantity is positive. Also, this quantity is positive. Since the sum of this, uh, the sum of two positive quantities is equals to 0. So, we have this quantity equals to 0. So, finally, and Now we have to solve these two equations. So from the first equation we have now sin square x equals to 0 implies sin x equals to 0. Therefore we have x equals to n pi where n belongs to z. And uh, let us let us take this second down that is 1 minus sin cube x equals to 0 so here we have and this implies now we will show that this quantity cannot be 0 so uh, if possible let this is equals to 0 Then, since this is equals to 0, then sin x cannot be equals to 0. If sin x equals to 0, then sin square x also equals to 0, then left hand side is equals to 1 and right hand side equals to 0. So, we have sin x not equal to 0. Now, from this equation, we have 1 plus sin square x equals to minus sin x. Now note that the left hand side is always positive and this is greater than or equals to 1 and the right hand side always less than or equals to 1 because sin x lies in minus 1 to 1 so we have this is less than or equals to 1 so the equality uh, happen only when so this implies 1 plus sin square x equals to 1 is the only possibility for equality and this implies sin square x equals to 0 and so sin x equals to 0 so thus we get a contradiction because we have sin x not equals to 0 so this gives a contradiction therefore this quantity that means 1 plus sin square x plus sin x is always non-zero therefore 1 minus sin x equals to 0 so we have 1 minus sin x equals to 0 and this implies sin x equals to 1. So from here we have 
x equals to 2n pi plus pi over 2 where n belongs to z and this can be written as 4n plus on pi over 2 where n belongs to z. Now uh, let let us take the second part. Yeah, now we will calculate from here that is cos square x times on minus cos cube x equals to 0. So we have and this implies cos x equals to 0. Since cos x equals to 0, we have n pi plus pi over 2 where n belongs to z and this can be written as now let us take the second part that is this one now we will calculate on minus cos cube x equals to 0 and this implies Using the similar argument before, we can show that on plus cos square x plus cos x is non-zero. So therefore, we have and this implies, so from here, we have where n belongs to z. Yeah, the set, z is the set of all integer. Now, let a be the set of solution for this equation then we have then we have a equals to yeah for x equals to n pi and the second solution is 4n plus on pi over 2 so that is n pi such that n belongs to z and 4n plus on pi over 2 such that n belongs to z and let b be the set of solution for this equation then we have x equals to 2n plus on over pi over 2 union also we have x equals to 2n pi now since we have this expression and this expression both need to be 0 so that means x lies in a intersection b now we have to find a intersection b so here a intersection b equals to yeah here we have n pi and here we have two n pi so the common is two n pi union here we have four n plus on pi over two and here we have two n plus on pi over two so the common is four n plus on pi over two. Therefore, the solution is given by and here n belongs to z. So, this is the complete solution and we are supposed to solve this equation for x and our solution is given by x equals to 2n pi and 4n plus 1 times pi over 2 where n is an integer. So, we are done. Thank you.